Tonight, the city of Draper is considering urban deer hunting. It would be one of a handful of cities across the state to choose that version of deer control. News for Utah's Nick McGurk explains what it is and how it may help live from Draper City Hall. Well, Kim, the city council meeting just wrapping up, and the police chief uh, telling the city council they've already had uh, $10,000 set aside to work on the deer problem, saying that it's a real issue in the city, uh, but not everybody agrees that killing deer in city limits is such a good idea. That's ridiculous. James Alger loves deer, so he came to Draper City Hall tonight to speak up for them and keep archers from killing them within city limits. A terrible, terrible problem, and I hope the city will do something. But others say the deer problem is out of control. Every spring, my gardens and my lawns is a literal waste dump. Tonight, a public comment period at City Hall. A deer decided to munch on it. Farmer Jeff Rasmussen wants the deer population managed, supporting the city's police chief who presented to the council a message that a certain population of deer are staying in the city, causing some traffic accidents and even causing expensive damage to plants and crops. What we don't have and what we're seeking for is some ordinance or some way to help those residents out that really do have significant property damages. So that's what this urban deer program is really designed to do is to give us an option, give us a tool. So the police chief pushing for an ordinance allowing lethal and non-lethal methods, one of which would be hiring archers. All the meat is immediately donated. Tonight, the city council voted to approve the measure with the provision that the city council will vote later on a fee for those who benefit from the city killing deer on their property. And the police chief saying this is not open season on deer in Draper. We're talking about specific areas in the valley where this is a huge issue. He said the archers that they would contract with have already done this in about 10 other cities throughout Utah. Live in Draper tonight, I'm Nick McGurk. News for Utah. Thank